on pages 352, heating uh, caloric uh, values um, find as the total heat produced when a unit of mass is burned completely. Okay, and what we're talking about now, we're going to be talking about waste fuels. All right, uh, not um, not um, we talked about in class in the on the uh, solid waste solid hazardous waste class. We talk about burning hazardous waste and that type of stuff. What we're really talking about here essentially is all this different type of uh, we did a simple, some simple exams, all right, or examples. Uh, we're gonna do, we're gonna get, gonna uh, basically get this down a little bit further, all right? Um, you know, in our in our uh, solid waste and our in our air class, uh, higher heating value is referred to HHV. That's basically the heating value. So when there's water present in the fuel, uh, flue gases, um, basically water is present in liquid form and sets at a lower heat, uh, lower heating value. When water is present in Vapor, quantity of water is equal to the latent heat of vaporization. Okay, what's the latent heat of vaporization? What, is, what does that really mean? From your thermodynamics class. Exactly. Riley, you get a gold star. <clears throat> So um, you have fuel values uh, for different common fuels in there, um, and from your in the NCWS uh, handbook, higher heating value or gross calorific value basically is done at 25 degrees C under STP conditions is how it's calculated. Uh, heating value is measured in units or energy per unit of substance, uh, kilojoules per kilogram or kilojoules per mole or kilocalories per kilogram, BTUs per uh, per Per uh, pound mass, uh, one kilocal to kilogram is one mega uh, mega joules uh, per kilogram times two thirty eight eight forty six. There's a basically values that you see in your handbook. Okay. Um, again, heating value is three fifty two. Lower heating value uh, determined by subtracting the heat of vaporization of the water. Um, basically treats any basically with uh, with wastes really any water that's formed as vapor right? um, and it's <clears throat> um, basically relating a higher heating value to a lower heating value uh, where HV okay is the heat of vaporization here right? based on the number of moles out okay based on the number of, uh, of the water coming out of the system or out of the, out of the process and basically n is the number of moles of the fuel right um, so basically, the higher heating, they're related. They're related to HHV, related to LVH, LHV. Excuse me. Uh, where LHV here is the heat of vaporization. 